The basic principles of pedery. Now, traits get passed down from parent to offspring by the sperm and the egg. The sperm is the male gamete, and the egg is the female gamete. Now, the sperm goes and fertilizes the egg, basically passing down the traits. When the sperm comes down to fertilize the egg, it brings half of his chromosomes, and the egg gives half of her chromosome to the offspring. A chromosome is a thread-like structure of genes that carries heterotry information, or DNA. DNA is a double-stranded nucleic acid that contains the genetic information for cell growth, division, and function. Alternative form of a gene. Hey Haley, I've got a question for you. Are the traits like separated or are they all the same? Well, the thing that separates this is a phenotype and a genotype. Uh-huh. This is a Putnam square. A Putnam square determines the outcome of what the offspring might look like based off of its parents. There's one more thing you need to know. The reason why we don't look exactly like our parents is because both of our parents do not carry all the dominant genes. So they have recessive and each one of them have their own dominant genes and they're mixed together to create us. We're a mixture of both of them and we each have both of their 23 chromosomes. So that makes us, so we have 46 chromosomes. When two people love each other very much, a sperm comes down, a gamete of a male comes down, and fertilizes the egg, the egg, a gamete of a female. This, when the sperm comes down and the egg gives the offspring 23 chromosomes, a regular human being has 46. A chromosome is wrapped up DNA. DNA it holds the genetic information. The genetic information codes for what the cells division and function. And each chromosome there is an allele. Alleles are alternate forms of a gene. And believe me, a Putnam Square just shows you the results of what your offspring might look like. Yeah. Nelson, Haley, what do you have to say? It's also very... Uh, um, um. I'm not going to answer. Go how interesting, but what I like to know is how does the child get its traits? DNA is the 